And let's take you to Bristol. Four people have this afternoon been cleared of criminal damage over toppling the statue of slave trader Edward Colston in Bristol and throwing it into the harbour. They are Rianne Graham, Milo Ponsford and Sage Willoughby, uh, as well as Jake Skews. Uh, they have been cleared today. Uh, warning there is flash photography as the four appear outside court having been found not guilty of criminal damage. They are due to say a few words. Let's uh, listen in to see uh, if they're about to speak. Guys, can we just ask you, how are you, how are you feeling about the verdict? We, we are and we feel ecstatic and stunned. <laughs> <laughs> the, I just, I can't wait 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 I tried to uh, write something ready for this moment and I'm just so overwhelmed because it never felt like we'd got we'd get here and now we're here and this is, we just want to say thank you to so many people because we have never been alone in this journey never, we've been yes, so yes. supported and we are you know we're such a small part of this really uh, like, there were so many people that day, so many people like reverberating across the world mm. in response to it. And so I should just consult my notebook and <laughs> mm. thank some really key people. Obviously, our legal team who have been incredible. I can't thank them enough for getting us through this. Bristol Defendant Solidarity, uh, Bristol Radical History Group. Yay! 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 <laughs> Glad Colston's gone. Solidarity Group. Um, where have we got all of our witnesses, our like, incredible witnesses who took the oath and, you know, put their name on the line to stand in court for us. Gloria Daniels, Clo Cleo Lake, Lloyd Russell, David Olashoga, Julian Stoyle, Roger Ball, who did so much of the research into Yay. all the history around here. Um, and a special mention to Judah Rabundi, who were, as well, who was supposed to be a witness and didn't get to, but has given me so much hope and fire to continue with this journey. Amazing. Um, all the donators to the crowdfunder, epic human beings. Yes, my um, nice work. All of our family and friends who have had to endure this year and a half journey with us also. Um, who have we got? Everybody on the day. That, those 10,000 people that marched the streets of Bristol in the name of equality for out of love. Out. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> all the rope pullers, the statue climbers, the rollers, the egg throwers, the marchers, the placards. Oh, you. All those people. You lot are incredible. And the international topplers, the people yes. that went and took their agency and did something in their hometown and changed the landscape of their place because that's one thing that's been a real big lesson for me is just being able to take agency in my own life and the fact that we all have ability to say how our space is decorated and how who we venerate and who we celebrate and one thing that we know now is that Colston does not represent Bristol. Yeah. <laughs> and Rhiannon, what, what do you say, of course... Hey, big thanks to Banksy! Hey. Big thanks to Banksy! Rhiannon, what, Rhiannon, what do you say to, to obviously, people who... You say you can't change history, and these monuments are part of, 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 of history, and they shouldn't be pulled down. What we was your reaction to that? We didn't change history. Yes, Sage. They were whitewashing history 